Slide 6. The pre embryonic period week 1. Sorry, week 2. Item 1. At approximately day 9, the blastocyst is embedded completely beneath the endometrial epithelium, and spaces appear in the situ trophoblast that in two days form the lacunae network by fusion. Item 2. The erosion into endometrial blood vessels by sensitive trophoblast marks days 11 and 12, forming uteroplacental circulation, which allows the maternal blood into the sensitive trophoblast lacunae networks. Also in days 11 and 12, the primary yolk sac forms, and part of the cytotrophoblast differentiate into extra embryonic mesoderm. The extraembryonic cilum derived from this extraembryonic mesoderma space eventually grows into the chorionic cavity. Item 3. By the end of week 2, the development of primary chorionic villi is observed. The primary yolk sac is replaced by the secondary yolk sac and the amniotic cavity appears as a space between the cytotrophoblast and the inner cell mass. Item 4. Also at this time, the inner cell mass further differentiates into a bilamina embryonic disc. The outer layer, the epiblast, is related to the amniotic cavity. The inner layer, the hypoblast, lies adjacent to the blastocyst cavity and is localized thickening the procoda plate, the cans, the future embryonic cranial region as illustrated by the image on the left.